This is the final mouse Starlight 12, the most sought after mouse of this year. Despite being made completely out of magnesium, it's one of the lightest high quality mice on the market right now, coming in at only 47 grams for the medium and 41 for the small. It's wireless and uses the standard final mouse honeycomb design and shape, has great PTFE feet and all of the clicks on my copy feel crisp and have minimal travel. Now mouse buttons 1 and 2 are quite heavy to actuate, but it's not necessarily a bad thing, especially if you butterfly click. Let me explain. The Starlight 12 has a double clicking problem. Now, despite not having any software to adjust the debounce time with, I can get an easy 20 CPS. This is comparable to mice like the Model O, Pulsefire Haze, and Hardy M. Here's a quick demo. Now, as to why this happens, it brings me back to the mouse buttons. Because of the tensioning as well as the material that they went with for the mouse, fucking metal, it transmits vibrations better than plastic. This means that it's easier to make the mouse buttons on the Starlight 12 bounce and in turn double click compared to regular plastic mice. If you're having trouble visualizing this, imagine hitting a drum set symbol or a triangle, then seeing it shake and vibrate. After that, hit something plastic. You'll realize that the metal objects have a brighter sound because of their resonance, and that means it vibrates more. Now back to why this is my personal favorite mouse of butterfly clicking, there are a few reasons. Firstly, it's only 47 grams and has a very good shape. This means it's really easy to aim with. Secondly, it's wireless, and aside from a few other mice, there aren't that many other options for good wireless double-clicking mice. And finally, I can clickbait it for views. Oh by the way, you can also drag click. All in all, I really like the Starlight, and while you can't get it now unless you wanna, you know, live off nothing but bread for the next few years, they're gonna restock on the 8th of November, though they will most likely sell out in 10 seconds again, so. Also, just a reminder, what you personally deem as the best mouse is completely up to you, since it's your money. You might think that the Starlight 12 is a complete waste of money and you're happy with your Model O or MM710, and I can completely respect that as well. In return, I just ask that you respect me, as well as other differing opinions in the comment section too. Aside from that, I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.